Quantum Theory, known in Japan as Kuantamu Siori, is a third-person shooter video game for the PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360. It is developed by Team Tachyon and published by Tecmo. The game was released in September 2010. The game centers on two characters named Sid and Filina who must fight through a living tower. The game features a cover system that constantly adds and removes cover. Gameplay The game is a third-person shooter incorporating a cover system. Players can fire their weapon from the hip, aim down the weapon sight for precision, or blindfire from cover. Enemies explode upon death and a successful headshot is rewarded by a slow-motion close-up view of the head exploding. Sid can throw Filina as a projectile weapon. Sid can use his guns as melee weapons. Sid's initial melee attack can also result in a follow-up attack by Filina. Some levels feature environments that can change dynamically, including moving platforms that Sid must hang onto or jump off. Bosses make appearances throughout the campaign, requiring the player to identify and target their weak points. Plot <inaudible> 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 Topic. Setting Set in an organic sci-fi world, years have passed since a world war left the world in a catastrophic state, leaving only a few survivors. In a new community, cocoon, life has been threatened by a black material called erosion, creating a post-apocalyptic environment. Surviving humans form a militia to conquer the erosion and set out to take down the living tower. The main character, Sid, intends to destroy the tower. He meets Filina along the way, as they both ascend to the top in their search for answers. The tower is constantly eroding, and intensifies as the game progresses. <laughs> story Most of the story takes place within the tower, beginning with Sid and a woman named Nyx trying to escape the tower as it begins to fall apart. As they continue to fight their way out, Nyx suddenly collapses, dying. Sid reveals that because she is part of the tower, she will die with it. Sid leaves Nyx behind telling her to die well. Sid then escapes the tower through unknown means. The story then was Sid when he takes up to an army of soldiers, flashes forward to where Sid and other soldiers fight through destroyed city streets against the Diablosis as they make their way into the living tower. A poisonous growth called the erosion lives there, and their mission is to destroy the tower along with the erosion. The entire squad Sid is with is wiped out but he manages to enter the tower. Sid meets Filina for the first time when he sees her fighting the Nosferatu and comes to her aid. After dispatching the enemy the two engage in a Mexican standoff, after which they go their separate ways in the tower. Filina and Sid meet again later on and reveal to each other their opposing quests. Sid is out to destroy the tower while Filina wants to save it from the erosion. The two battle to a stalemate as their fight is interrupted by the Diablosis, whom they must fight together in order to survive. The two agree to join forces for the time being. Filina tells Sid that her father created the tower, while throughout the story a voice speaks through the loudspeaker in the tower, providing context. Later in the game flashback levels show Sid as a rookie, donning a mask which is broken in a later flashback, resulting in the X-shaped scar on Sid's forehead. During this time he was part of a squad of exiled Gilskins, the leader carrying the revenant weapon Sid now uses. The entire squad is wiped out during a battle with Diablosis, only Sid survives, now using the leader's revenant. Sid and Filina belong to warring factions, the Gilskins and the Nosferatu, respectively. Sid and Filina join together, but split up later on. Sid and Filina meet up again, and Filina discovers that she is not human, but the prototype of a new breed of humanoids that her father had engineered. She is also the missing component that would empower the Diablosis as they merge with the erosion. Sid and Filina battle the main Diablosis, but the Diablosis eventually absorbs Filina. Sid kills it and frees Filina. Filina and Sid make their way up to the top floor of the tower before confronting the brain of the tower, which instructs Filina to kill Sid. Filina points her weapon at Sid only to change her mind at the last second and open fire on the brain. This causes the entire tower to be destroyed. 
After the credits both Sid and Filina are seen going towards another tower. Reception Quantum Theory received mostly negative reviews, with a Metacritic aggregate score of 37 one hundredths for the Xbox 360 version and 43 one hundredths for the PlayStation 3 version. <laughs>